at a front row seat tonight at Memorial Stadium to see what BC has been building this season. I mean, Rachel, when you have one of the toughest schedules in the country, I think it's hard to expect sunshine and rainbows, but I know two losses to begin the season was not what the cadets expected. What's been impressive is the way they've responded. They've turned it around, won three straight, and I think they've truly proven to be one of the best in 4A. Absolutely. They were looking for their fourth straight win tonight with Ware County in town. But the Gators have given the cadets some trouble in recent years, so getting there was not going to be an easy task. And they realized that pretty quick. Their first possession of the game, they get all the way to the quarter yard line. But Ware County stops them on fourth down, keeping BC off the board. Now, Benedictine would get on the scoreboard on the following possession. Stephen Cannon tosses it out to Joshua Washington. And Joshua Washington oh, taking it all the way. That's a touchdown, cadets. Fire that cannon. Side note, that cannon really loud. That is the little shake that you just saw on that camera. Apologies. <laughs> We're counting, getting a crack at it now. QB Luke Hooks getting over to the sideline and picking up some yardage. But the BC defense coming to play on third down. They get the stop and force the field goal. So it's 7-3, to three, cadets. That is until about 9 to go in the half. When Steven Cannon says no receivers necessary, guys, he takes it himself to make it 14 to three. But the second half would be a completely different story. The BCQB leaving the game with a shoulder injury and Ware County goes on to win it 38 to 14. Yeah, the cadets will bounce.